Since it's one of the major features touted in the TS1, I thought we'd give face recognition a try. Um, and this is the difference where you can actually program faces in. Here I've programmed six faces into the camera with their names. So the names will show up next to the images. So let's see how it does here. Anna, obviously that's the photograph I used to record it. And this is William, also the photograph I used. Now this is not Anna, this is her aunt. Uh, and this is a picture of me and my son William, which it tends to think I'm Anna for some reason. I'm not sure why that would happen, but uh, not sure why we look so alike. Uh, and that is William, that is not Anna. This is Thomas, this is the photograph I used to program. That is not Thomas. And this is a picture of Thomas, his mother, and his brother William. And everybody but Thomas is Thomas in this picture. Now this is a picture of Luke and Rob, our lab techs downstairs. And that's Luke, and now he is going to become Thomas. Um, Rob came up as Thomas earlier, but then I tried all I could to get him to come up as Rob. He is programmed into the database, but he didn't come in. So it uh, looks like it's a technology that has yet to... Uh, be refined a little bit, but it's interesting nonetheless.